Member for Vancouver, Kensington. Thank you very much, Honourable Speaker. As members will recall, the Legislative Assembly appointed a special committee to review the Personal Information Protection Act, or PIPA as it's known. As chair of the committee, I'm joined by the very capable vice chair, the MLA from Penticton, and I appreciate the opportunity to speak today about our work. PIPA governs how private sector organizations collect, use, and disclose personal information. It also requires organizations to protect and secure personal information against unauthorized use or disclosure and grants individuals the right to access their own personal information. We know that we have become more reliant than ever on technology to stay connected with friends and family and to do our work. Now is an opportune time to modernize our private sector privacy legislation in response to this new reality. We also want to ensure that BC businesses are supported in protecting and using the personal information they collect so they can remain competitive and successful. Our committee is currently undertaking a public consultation as part of our work, and we're looking forward to hearing from British Columbians about the Act. We'll be holding a number of virtual public hearings in the coming weeks to hear from subject matter experts and other stakeholders. On behalf of all committee members, I encourage everyone to take some time to share their thoughts on how to strengthen this important piece of legislation. The committee is accepting input until July 30th. More details on how to participate are available on our committee website, and I would like to encourage all members to share this information with individuals and organizations in their communities who may be interested in participating. And the committee's work will be presented to the, legisl to the Legislative Assembly and made public by December 8th this year. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.